Primates are characterized by four shared derived characters, including hands and feet adapted for grasping, a large brain and short jaws, forward-looking eyes close together on the face, providing depth perception, and finally, complex social behavior and parental care. The earliest group of primates include the lemurs of Madagascar and the lorises and bush babies of tropical Africa and South Asia. Another early group of primates are tarsiers from Southeast Asia. Lemurs, lorises, bush babies, and tarsiers are mostly arboreal, which means that they live in the trees. They are also nocturnal and have large eyes adapted for night vision. The rest of the primates fall under a clade known as arthropoids including monkeys and apes, which are characterized by having fully opposable thumbs adapted for grasping. Monkeys consist of two groups, the New World monkeys such as spider monkeys found in the Americas, and the Old World monkeys such as macaques found in Eurasia. While both groups of monkeys are diurnal, they differ in two main ways. New World monkeys have nostrils that open to the sides and a prehensile tail adapted for grasping while Old World monkeys have nostrils that open downward and lack a prehensile tail. The remaining primates belong to the clay hominoids, informally known as apes, which are tailless. Gibbons are smaller apes found only in Southeast Asia and are characterized by long arms and fingers adapted for brachiating, which means swinging by the arms from branch to branch. The rest of the apes belong to the clay hominid, informally known as great apes. Orangutans live in rainforests of Southeast Asia. They are the most arboreal of the great apes. They have proportionally long arms and short legs, and they have reddish-brown hair covering their bodies. Orangutans are primarily frugivores. The remaining great apes belong to the clay hominini, informally known as African apes. Gorillas inhabit the tropical forests of sub-Saharan Africa. They are the largest living primates and are ground-dwelling herbivores. The group of apes most closely related to humans are chimpanzees and bonobos which belong to the clay hominini. Chimpanzees and bonobos are intelligent, communicative, and social. They have been found to use tools for hunting and foraging. They are omnivores with more than half of the diet consisted of fruits. Lastly, humans and other closely related extinct relatives belong to the clay hominina, also known as hominins. Hominins are characterized by reduced canine teeth and foramen magna, the hole through which spinal cord passes located underneath the skull, allowing upright posture. The oldest hominins were Sahelanthropus chidensis, who lived about 6.5 million years ago. The hominins from 4 to 2 million years ago were collectively known as astrolopiths. They are characterized by full bipedalism, which means that they walk fully erect. Our genus Homo appeared around 2.6 million years ago. Homo habilis have a shorter jaw and a larger brain volume than the earlier Australopiths. Some fossils of Homo habilis indicated that they utilized sharp stone tools. Homo ergaster from around 1.9 to 1.5 million years ago had a substantially larger brain than Homo habilis, as well as long slender legs with hip joints adapted for long-distance walking. Homo ergaster also exhibited less sexual dimorphism, meaning that there is less size difference between males and females. Homo erectus originated in Africa and was the first hominin to migrate outside of Africa. Homo neanderthals were found in Europe and the Near East. Results from genetic analyses show that a small percentage of Eurasians contain Neanderthal genomes. Neanderthals went extinct about 28,000 years ago. Lastly, our species Homo sapiens emerged around 200,000 years ago in Africa. Humans share many ancestral traits of early hominins including bipedalism, complex tool use, larger brain, and decreased sexual dimorphism. In addition, humans are capable of using language to express symbolic thoughts, which is encoded by the FOXP2 gene.